Welcome back. We are clear and cool this morning. We've got a look out of our Junction City camera. Hard to tell right now, but we've got clear skies overhead. And we'll take a look out of Emporia as well, where we do have those clear skies still. You can even see some of those stars showing up this morning. Now, as we go through it the rest of the day, we'll likely see mostly sunny skies, maybe just a few passing clouds at times, but our temperatures fairly chilly out there. We're in the 40s and 30s. We're sitting at 37 in Marysville, 41 in Hiawatha, 44 degrees in Topeka. Emporia checking in at 44 degrees as well, and we're at 42 degrees in Manhattan and Junction City. Our winds are running about 5 to 10 miles per hour out of the west for the most part. We'll start to see those picking up just a little bit going throughout this afternoon, becoming a little bit breezy for us. So we'll take a look at our future wind starting this at 9 a.m. this morning. Winds coming west-northwest about 10 miles per hour. Those pick up out of the west running about 10 to 15 miles per hour later on this afternoon. And then we'll start to see those backing off tonight, turning out of the south and west briefly. And then we've got that cold front moving through early tomorrow morning. That's going to turn our winds to the north and west again. They'll run about 10 to 15 once again through the afternoon, maybe a little bit breezier at times gusts up to 20 to 25 miles per hour and then we'll see those backing off once again late Wednesday into early Thursday. Now that cold front pushes through early tomorrow but our cooler air is actually going to lag behind it just a little bit so we'll take a look at our future temperatures too. This starts at 730 this morning. We've got those temperatures in the low to mid 40s. Maybe even a few more spots hitting 30s. We'll take a we'll keep an eye on that through the morning. Temperatures this afternoon will make it up into the low to mid 70s. We'll be slightly cooler in the eastern half of the area just a touch warmer in our west Western counties and overnight tonight temperatures will be in those low to mid 50s for the most part. For tomorrow, things should warm up into the mid to upper 70s despite that cold front coming through early. Like I said, that colder air is going to lag behind just a little bit for us. So by Wednesday night, temperatures will fall into the mid 40s, maybe even some low 40s showing up. And then through the daytime on Thursday, we could even have a few communities struggling to get out of the 50s and much of us will be in the lower 60s as we go through the daytime on Thursday. And here's a look at our satellite and radar. We've got those clear skies overhead and we'll continue to see mostly sunny skies throughout the daytime today but we do have this low pressure system here in Canada and that's going to give us just a few clouds riding that uh, jet stream for us sinking into northeast Kansas as we go throughout the later parts of this afternoon so don't be surprised if we see a few passing clouds here and there but we'll stay dry all the way through the work week this is a look at our future track starting Friday morning maybe just a few clouds and then we'll start to see those clouds increasing Friday night as another system approaches us we'll have a cold front coming through on Saturday Saturday too, and that could bring us a chance for some showers going throughout the daytime Saturday and then lingering throughout the afternoon before slowly tapering off for us as we head into the early morning hours on Sunday. Now our temperatures, they'll be really nice today and tomorrow despite having that breezy wind in place, so we'll still be able to make it up into the low to mid 70s. And then the cooler air arrives for Thursday and Friday. We may be talking about our first frost early Friday morning if those winds can back off fast enough and will become calm early Friday. And then we'll stay well below average in the 60s through the weekend. Yeah, if that doesn't happen in Manhattan or Topeka Friday morning, it could happen north. Yeah, especially in low-lying areas, we might see some of that. So we'll be keeping a close eye. And don't worry about Saturday. Chance of rain really small. Yeah, I mean, still. you got it 20% right now. Mm -hmm.